guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to this humongous Timu haul. I say Timu, I know it's Temu, but Timu is just the way it comes out of my mouth. This is part one. Part two will be a Halloween haul. I'm just waiting for one more little thing to come in and then it'll make it complete. Hopefully, hopefully I won't buy any more. So what we have here today is just everyday, random, spontaneous things. And I have been collecting this stuff for months and I've just been waiting to get a substantial amount to give a really nice haul for you. And then I started thinking about it for the last several weeks and I started getting overwhelmed and more and more kept coming in and I was like, I've got to get this done. So let's get started, shall we? I'm not going in any particular order. So, the first thing I have here is this um, bag of jewelry boxes. I just got this one size. Um, I can't remember how many are in a pack, but as always, I'll have all of the info up on the screen for you. But these are a lot skinnier than I thought they would be, but they're just fine. And you open them up and each one has a velvet little sponge in it. And it's got like this little hook on top so you can hook your necklace there and then it won't move. And then you can hang it. And then it's got a little black elastic at the bottom so that you can put it over the necklace and then it just stays in one place. These are actually quite nice. I didn't know they were gonna be like that. So I got some of these because I like to make jewelry, bracelets, necklaces. I just love it. And to mail it all in when I mail things out, I got a pack of these envelopes. They're plastic mailers. I got this size and then I got a little smaller size. Um, yeah, so these, I have not opened them. Here they are, they're quite honeycombish, but they, they, um, they're okay. I think they could be more padded actually. So I'll probably end up, when I mail things, um, I'll probably add a little bit more bubble wrap around the item. But dang, I didn't realize it was this small. This will get lost in the mail. Holy cow. I don't know about these. These are extra small. What about these? Goodness gracious. <laughs> what the heck? These are barely bigger. You've got to be kidding me. I mean, they give the dimensions and the measurements on these things, but I don't know. I just think they're always going to be bigger. I mean, I guess I just don't know how to read measurements, but <laughs> these are going to get lost in the mail. I just don't know. I mean, I guess I can try. They're just awfully small, but I guess I've mailed little greeting cards this small and they've arrived. Wow, I just had no idea they were that small. I should have looked at them when I first got them, but oh well. And there were quite a bit in there and they were fairly inexpensive, so. And then, these are just silly little random things. I picked these up. I just, they just popped up randomly. I'm like, what are those? And so I've already used one. It came in a pack of three, but these are just cheap little metal rings and they are to help you make jewelry. So um, when you take your pliers, you put your little round ring in there, your finding, and then you can pry it open and um, you just stick it in the slot. And there are three different sizes, like for itty bitty thin rings, like O-rings or whatever you call them. And then there's a one for fatter ones, but these work pretty well. You just stick it in there and you take your pliers and you just kind of press against and then your little ring opens up and then you can put it back together again. So, I don't know, I don't even, these weren't even a dollar. And they totally smell like those rings that you used to get when you were a kid from the gumball machines. 
and they turned your finger green immediately. That's what these smell like, but they're fine. They're perfect. They're very handy for making necklaces. And then these would have totally, these would look cute with what I'm wearing today. I'm wearing just this white shirt and some blue shorts, but I got these super cute earrings. Um, they're the evil eye earrings and I haven't even taken them out of the package. Um, these were in my cart. I had them in gold, but they popped up. They also have them in silver, silver and gold. And um, when I, they popped up on my, on my screen, like, hey, these are only gonna be one cent today if you want them. And so I clicked on them and put them in my cart, but I forgot to click golden. But these silver ones are darling and they are just so beautiful. You don't even know. They are really, really well made. I love them a lot. And I just think they would look so cute with what I have on today. And they come with a rubber backing and you get an extra set of rubber backings. But for a penny, heck yeah, they're very nice. And then I got these beads. I thought they were gonna be a little bit bigger because I wanted to make bracelets out of them, but these are really, really tiny. But the colors are nice. Um, yeah, I thought they were gonna be a tiny bit bigger, but they'll be, they'll still be great. But anyway, they're just more, they're colors that you don't see all the time. They're kind of earth toned, so. I like them. We'll see how they are. I don't know if they're really plasticky or if they're a nice bead. I don't know. And the last thing in this pack, oh, <laughs> I got a three pack of these cards. Got you a birthday card. And you know what? You gotta be careful when you order these. These did not come with envelopes. Some come with envelopes and some don't, and now I know. So these did not come with an envelope. So I had to search the house and try to find a matching envelope. Um, but I thought they were so funny and they're just blank inside, but got you a birthday card. <laughs> okay, so that's all for that sack. Let's try. I'll do that. I've got some clothes. I'll do those later. Oh, goodness. Okay. Sticking to the jewelry theme, I grabbed a whole bunch of these. So these are just little tags that um, you can use to wrap around your bracelets or your necklaces. I have not taken them out. They've got a rubber band around them. Oh, okay. They're quite nice. So they've got a little punch hole that you can take out if you wanted to hang out on a rack. And then you fold them up and there's this sticker so you can stick it together. And then this says handmade with love. And you can also put earrings in there as well. So I just, thought I'd make I'd grab some of these I don't make earrings but I can certainly hang necklaces and um, bracelets from them I don't sell my jewelry I just give it all away I just make it and give it that's just how I roll and here are some fun little beads I didn't mean to order two but these are they say they're fire polished beads but they're not they're plastic. Fire polished, I have some, and they are really nice. These, I knew that they were gonna be plastic. It's like a bead inside a plastic casing, a faceted plastic casing. Um, they had all different colors. I should have got a purple set, but um, they're just little. And I don't know, you probably can't really see that, but they're, they're decent, they're cute. They'll make a cute um, Halloween necklace or bracelet. But yeah, I actually got two of those. 
And then I got this color. It's kind of a champagne color. I think it's really pretty. Anyway, they're okay. I'm glad I got them. And then I got some natural beads or stones. So these are, I don't know what you call them, but they're really pretty. <laughs> I haven't even looked at these, but they're super teeny tiny. I didn't realize they're going to be this small, but I love them, how tiny they are. Super pretty. So I got those. And then these are even smaller. These little pink ones are teeny tiny. And I had no clue. And they give the measurements, but I had no clue. But they're darling. So they're those clay beads that... Um, make really cute bracelets but I've just never seen them this size before super tiny and they came in all different colors and I chose this pale pink but I will definitely be ordering more um, they're adorable and then I got this pack of natural beads they're a little different shape They're kind of, I don't know if they're a shell. They feel like a shell, but those are super cute. So I got those. I got these nail art stickers. Oh, they are so cute. And they've got itty bitty tiny ones. I just, I don't know how much I paid for these, like 30 cents or something. I don't know, but they are so cute. I haven't used them yet, but... Oh my gosh, they would be cute on like my thumb or my big toe or something. I just think they're so adorable. Or put the teeny tiny one on my pinky or maybe my ring finger. I don't know. I just thought they were adorable, so I had to get them. Because I'm into the evil eye craze, as you will see pretty soon. I got this net bag. This is a bag that holds your water bottle. And it's decent, I guess. I haven't used it. It's quite flimsy, but it's decent. You know, I just got it, and it's got a little pocket in front if you wanted to put some credit cards or money, and then you put your water bottle. It's for a plastic water bottle It's not, or some juice or something. It's not for your Stanley cup or anything like that. It's really small. But I got it so that when I'm out doing yard work, I can just sling it over my shoulder and have my water with me because in Utah it gets so hot and when I'm out there weeding or mowing the lawn I can just have this hanging here which I should have been using this whole summer but I haven't because I've just been leaving it in the closet for this haul <laughs> but yeah this will be handy because when I get out there in the backyard and mow the lawn and and work back there it just gets so hot and you always have to stop, go get your water, you know, so I'll just have it with me and I can just stand there and drink some and then go back on my way. So anyway, and they had a few different colors. I thought I ordered black, but I guess I ordered blue. I don't even remember, but it's decent. I like it. And it's just got this little, little tag that looks kind of cool. What else have we got in here? This is going to be a long video, so I hope you can bear with me. I got this purse holder. You know, I don't need this. I actually have one from Dollar Tree. It looks like the big hook. I don't even know if they sell them anymore, but I like it because it's super flat. But this was intriguing. It's the round ones that open up like this. Um, it's quite flimsy. I thought it was gonna be a little nicer, but, but it's nice. Um, it's plain. It's not supposed to have anything there. I think they had silver too. But um, yeah, it just hangs on the table ledge and then you can hang your purse from it. Um, I've got a purse with extra wide straps, so I'm not sure how well that's going to work out. But anyway, I just thought it was nice because it's so little and you can just drop it into your purse. So I got that. My mom had a really nice one from QVC. 
I should have kept it, but I don't know. I didn't keep it. Um, what is this? I don't remember. Oh, I know what this is. This is a, gar a garbage can for your car or boat or whatever. I have a garbage can from Timu in my car and it's a boingy one and you can like fold it back and make it flat. And then when you open it, it, it's about this big and about this big around. And I actually like that. Um, but when you, if you hung it from your gear shift and it hangs down, it gets in people's way because it's so big and round. So I thought, well, I, I need a nice flat one. And it's got this, I don't know, elastic opening right here. And then the bottom um, actually opens up its Velcro bottom and then you just dump out your garbage and it's strong. I've never opened this up yet. Um, and then you can just dump it out from the bottom like this. Um, the one thing though, the one that I have in my car right now that's round, I like it because you can add a little garbage bag in there. They, they've got these little tiny black garbage bags that you can buy. That way, if you have something like gum or something wet, it just doesn't get your bag nasty. It just, you just take out the little in the liner, but you can't really do that with this. I mean, you can, but you're going to have to be extra careful. I don't know when you put stuff in because it's you've got this little hole here, but I mean, it's okay. It's, all right. I don't know. <laughs> it is what it is. I just, eh, it's all right. And then I got this really cute hair pin. I haven't used it yet. I haven't used any of this stuff yet. Um, this is a gold one. It's a kitty. It's a kitty head, I guess, kitty ears. And they also had silver tone. This is gold tone, but like you can just, if you have I think it'd be cuter with a lower bun, but you just stick this in your bun and I don't know, it looked cuter on in the picture like with a lower bun, you just kind of um, go like that and it, it sticks out, it looked cute. I don't know if, if or when I'll ever use it, but I hope so and it was inexpensive of course really cheap and then these I also got for one penny did I get two they sent me two of these actually where did they go I don't know what I did oh wait no I got one of these and then I got two of another pair but these were in my cart and so they were offered at one penny and so I like okay I grabbed them up I thought they were gonna be a lot bigger than this but this is the perfect little size and the metal is really nice. Um, I don't think they'll tarnish anytime soon, but they're super cute. They're just little flowers on a hoop. And I really do like that size. And for, a, for one cent, if they end up tarnishing, no big deal. These are so cute these earrings and these are nice quality and i have they accidentally shipped me two i only ordered one i didn't get charged for them they are so pretty i love them they're just a little hoop and it opens up nicely on a hinge like that and they are just adorable i know you can't really see but they are the perfect little size. They're so pretty. I love them. Oh, you know, these things are hit and miss. Sometimes the metal is good and sometimes it's bad. Like I can tell this, these aren't the greatest, these little flowery ones, but this metal, it's going to be fine. I don't think they're going to really tarnish. So I got those and I did, I did actually wear this. I forgot. This is a star necklace, and I think you could get it in gold or silver, so I got it in gold, and it says make a wish. 
but this was so cute. I wore it on the 4th of July. It is so cute. Just a plain little star on a plain chain. It was adorable. I, I just thought it was so cute. And then I've got some little gold star earrings that went perfectly with this. Yeah, I like this a lot. And this looks like the good stuff that won't tarnish anytime soon. I forgot I got that. I loved it. It's so cute. Oh, this is um, just an extra piece that I ordered for, I have a, this is a cell phone holder and I like it because it's like a clip so it can actually hold my cell phone with the cell phone holder and the pop socket. And it's super strong. I have a piece uh, that clips to my visor and it hangs down and I put this on the end of it. Um, it, ha it came with a different sized, um, it came with a different holder, but I like these clip holders. And the one that's on there now, the spring is kind of shot and so it doesn't hold it as tightly. So I ordered a new, just a new piece. And I love these and this was heavy duty and your phone will not fall out of this. It's awesome. I think I got it for a couple bucks. So I got that to replace the old one. What is this? Oh, I got these earrings. I don't know, I'm just really into stars. And then I ordered these around July or June and I thought, oh, 4th of July, but I didn't get these ones in time, but these are nice. This metal is nice. These are kind of heavy. Well, not heavy, but they do have a little bit of weight to them. They are so cute. Let me turn them around there backwards. So they've got stars cascading this way. And then, okay, here's the front. And they're, they're itty bitty um, crystals on some of them like that one has a crystal and then the middle one doesn't but the big one does i'm sorry i'm all fingers but they're just so pretty and then it just goes to the other side and they open up on a hinge like this and they snap shut but ah oh, i just think they're so fun they're so cute and they're so well made these are nice these are really nice. These are a little bit more money, but these are so nice. I forgot all about them. Let's see. Oh, you're gonna love this. So when I got this, I almost died. It was so adorable and it's nice. It's a little ring and it's in this little pack here. I already tried it on, it's a size six. I wear a size five on my ring finger, but they only had six and, a, and above. So it's a little evil eye ring and I thought it was gonna be a lot bigger, but look how teeny tiny these little eyes are. And this is gold tone. Oh man, this is so cute. I love it so much, so much. And I had no idea the little eyes were gonna be that small. They're teeny. I love this so much. And I I get I can't remember if it said it was sterling silver with gold verme over it, but um the little picture I have will tell you. Yep, sterling 925, the little imprints on the inside. This is nice and it's just so teeny tiny, I love it. It's just adorable. Oh, I'm just gonna leave it on. It's just so cute. What? Oh, and then I got these little star earrings. I ordered gold, golden, but they gave me the silver, which are really cute. And these are really nice. They're good quality, I can tell. You know how you can just see it and feel it? These are adorable. But I got them, I wanted them in gold so I could wear them on my two little holes here and wear them with those little star earrings I just showed you. Um, and so I ordered them again in gold 
And then when my order came, they weren't in the bag. And so I'm just not even gonna try ordering them again, but they are really nice and they're so cute. Love them. I got these fun earrings. These are also evil eye earrings. Oh, they're so cute. Where the heck? Oh, and I got the golden ones. And these, I'm trying to get to the right side, but they're just itty bitty hoops and they are adorable. I love them. And then they just are teeny. You could even wear one like in the middle hole. They're just so adorable. I just love how teeny tiny they are. Love them. Told ya, I just obsessed with this evil eye stuff. Ah, here's a big evil eye. I don't know, this one's kind of cheesy. I, I thought I'd just put it on my purse or something. But this is nice for a zipper pull, I guess. I don't know if I'm really gonna put this on much of any. It's a monster eye. It, it's really cute though. It's really nicely made and it's enamel and it's got the little glitter in there. And they had silver tone and they had different shapes. I chose this particular one. But I mean, I like it and I'll, I'll use it, but it was just a little harsh. I mean, I knew it was gonna look like this, but then when I got it in real life, I was like, whoa, that thing's kind of staring at me. So I don't know, it's okay though, I like it. And then I got, these are the last little evil eyes I got and they are earrings. And it came with four and they're all the same size. And I thought that a pair was, like one pair was supposed to be itty bitty, but they're these are all the same size. So anyway, I got them in gold. And so I can wear them with the little hoops. Like I can put them on these two holes here and then use the little hoops in the main holes. <laughs> but anyway, I just, if you type in evil eye, so many things pop up. I mean, it's not just jewelry. They've got all sorts of stuff and they're so cute and they have all different patterns and styles. It's insane. And the last thing in this bag, I got this pack, I got hair everywhere, this pack of um, bags. I use these for my bracelets or jewelry or whatever, but they're just little cellophane bags and they had different laser patterns. I got the stars, they're so cute. And they're self-adhesive, so you've got the little sticker and then you fold it down and it sticks. These are just so cute, I love them. So I got those, and I did think they were a little bigger when I bought them, but they're pretty narrow, but they're still fine. The last bag has a lot of clothes. So the first item, I got this. Um, at first I got a medium, and it was too big, so I, I got a small, and it's still big. I'm wondering if this is even a medium again. But I saw this and I had to have it. It's a tiny bit different than the real thing. Like, you know, these are all remakes of the picture, but um, it's still super cute. And I like the longer sleeves and it's got a little V-neck and it's polyester, but it's the nice silky kind. But it's really cute. I've tried it on and, you know, I'll just, you can leave it out, but I'll probably wear them with a white short and then probably do like a little bit of a French tuck, leave the back out, leave the front tucked in a little bit. But I really like it, it's super cute. It is bright, very summery, but it's really cute. And then I got this cute shirt. This is also polyester. And this is a size medium, I believe. But yeah, I just, Thought it was cute and simple and I can totally wear it with these pants kind of sorta 
Um, I'm gonna wear them with like dark navy, like dark denim jeans or shorts or white shorts. But yeah, and I tried it on and it's really cute. So there's that. And then they sent me this and I didn't order it. I'm like, what is this? And it's cute, but it's just not my style. I'll see if my sister-in-law wants it. She goes boating a lot and this would be cute for just like a beach or to put over your swimming suit and go shopping in or whatever. But I just, I don't know. I'm just not into the stripes. It's like a big old piece of fruit stripe gum, but it's a dress. And, um, and it's the polyester, but <laughs> yeah, it's, um, it's a bad angle, I know. But anyway, it's a dress and it's got a pleat right here in the back, which is nice. I just don't, I don't know why they sent this to me. I did not order it and it didn't say like you get a free gift or anything. So, and they didn't charge me for it. I don't think, I don't know if this, they had sent me this by accident and in place of a different thing I ordered. I don't even remember, but anywho, um, I'll see if my sister-in-law wants it. She can wear it on their boat or whatever, you know what I mean? Um, then I got this really cute shirt, blouse, and it's polyester. And it looks like a nice watercolor. It's so cute. And it's got the little bell sleeves with the little ruffle on the end. And I just love it. I can't remember if I got a small or a medium. And you know, these things never give you the size tag on them, but super cute, super cute. I like this one probably the best. And then I think I got this one. I still have another shirt in there. Um, this is polyester. I don't know. Some of these are, some of these are in a small and some of them are in a medium, but this one's fun. It's, they have a lot of blouses with this print, but this is kind of pink and gray and white. Um, I like it. It looked cute on and I like how the sleeves are nice and long. Um, so I think I will probably only wear this with white pants, maybe some dark jeans. I don't know. I'm always like, what am I going to wear these with? You know, then I got this. It looked so cute in the picture and I knew it was going to be different. I mean, it's not too different, but I think the spacing of the polka dots is a little different. I love the style and it looked so cute on, but I just feel like a loaf of Wonder Bread or like a clown, like I need to go into the circus. I don't know. It's so adorable though. I love the style. It looked so cute on. So I'm torn. I don't know if I want to wear this or not. I mean, I guess, but I just feel silly in it. I don't know, it's, I don't know what it is. It looked really cute on, in the picture on the girl. I just don't know, I just don't know. I just feel like a loaf of Wonder Bread. I just don't know. So we'll see. <laughs> and then I got some pajamas. Um, these are both in size medium and I love them. They're soft and boingy, kind of like what you can find at Walmart. And they're just super cute and they're the right length. They're not too long. Sometimes I'll get like, last year I got some pants that were mediums, but they were super long. Um, but I like these a lot. They're really nice. They have a good stretch. And then here's the top. They're just plain, but I love pajamas and a lot of my pajamas are so stinking old. So I needed these. And then this pair I like, but um, you know, sometimes they make things a little smaller 
I mean, these are mediums, but the waist is still a tiny bit tight, even though it's elastic and it's kind of bothersome. So I don't know. Um, maybe, I don't know if it was this pair actually, or the, or this pair, I'll have to try them on again, but this pair is actually a little thinner. I like the feel of this more than these. These kind of were more cottony, but these are a little more thin and silky. So, and they're just, they're just a plain style, but they're really cute. And this one, I'm like, what is this? A maxi pad? It's an eye thing to wear at night. I'm like, what is this? I'm like, does this go in the, in the bottoms? You know, but then I saw the strap. I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> So anyway, I'll have, I can't remember which one was a little tight, so I might have to kind of pop the elastic a little bit, but hey, okay. oh my gosh, that's all you guys, that's it. So, all right, if you made it to the very end of this video, please give me a big thumbs up and let me know below that you watched all the way to the end and tell me the thing you like the best. Um, thanks so much for watching. This was really fun. I can't wait to show you my Halloween haul. It's coming up soon. Have a great day, take care, and thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye.